A very good day to you people. My name is Mohit and today I'll show you something which is really really sought after the fastest and the quickest and the simplest way of actually making a flash photo gallery. Guys for this example I'll be using just three images. You can time me. The timer can start now and should not take more than two three minutes to do that. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on uh, create new action script 3 file in flash. It will present me with a blank uh, document a blank stage next one I'm gonna say is I'm gonna say file and then I'm gonna say import I'm gonna import in uh, three pictures that are lying on my desktop I'm gonna select the first one they're all JPEG images guys they're named pick one pick two and pick three I'm gonna say open to the first one and uh, flash CS 5.5 automatically understand that they are a part of a sequence that says do you want to import all of the images in the sequence I'll say yes the added advantage in doing this is it'll bring in all the three pictures and will place them all together on three different frames I don't have to do it will center them too that's fantastic okay I'll take the playhead back to the very first picture I'll select the first picture I'll go to windows and then I'll go to code snippets and then I'll choose uh, under animation folder the option fade in a movie clip and uh, flash says that it will be first converted to a um, movie clip before uh, a code snippet can be applied to it I'll say okay okay now guys uh, this is a code snippet and these are the comments comments don't really act they just are instructions so I'm gonna delete the comments guys this code snippet will actually make the alpha grow go from 0 to 1 for this specific image okay I'll do likewise with the second image too I'm gonna select the image go to windows go to code snippets and fade in a movie clip it's okay and uh, guys notice that it auto inserted this actions layer also inserted the actions the snippets the action script got auto inserted the actions layer got auto inserted and the first and the second image got automatically converted to movie clips wasn't that cool I'm gonna select the third image now I'm gonna say windows I'm gonna say code snippets and the same routine under the animation folder fade in a movie clip double click and say ok and guys I'm gonna get rid of all the comments ok I don't need the comments okay guys if I'm gonna run the uh, photo slideshow now it'll not run properly I'll tell you why in a minute nothing happens it just appears as a, a blank window that's because we are using the enter frame event and um, what is happening now is that uh, the movie or the playhead is running from the first to the second second to the third frame we are not allowing it time to actually understand and execute the script so the first thing that we need to do is we need to stop the playhead so that it can actually read the script assimilate the script and execute the script and then after stopping it I should allow the script to go ahead uh, to the next frame only once the alpha reaches one or goes over one okay so I'm gonna say if movie clip underscore one dot alpha goes over one then take it to the next frame so it's next frame parent parent semicolon okay let me just uh, copy this and then place the script on all the three frames so I'm gonna say stop on the second frame two and next frame parent parent semicolon and s likewise on the third frame too so it's a stop parent parent semicolon but uh, guys for the third frame I don't need to uh, I need to just say uh, I don't need to say next frame I need to say go to and play the first frame and that should do the trick let me just test the movie now so the first picture the second picture fading in nicely and the third picture that should loop back to the first picture 
so that's very very cool guys i hope you learned something good useful you'll implement it uh, all the best i'll see you next time bye bye